Sometimes to be innovative in e-commerce, you don't need to reinvent the wheel. You just need to think a little bit outside the box. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you a brand that's popping off right now. And I'm going to show you why they're so successful, the trend behind the product, the website, the marketing, so that by the end of it, you'll basically have a really good idea on how you can start a successful e-commerce business in untapped markets. So we're not going to waste any time. The store is called BroGlow. And if you use TikTok at all, You've probably seen this brand before. They're starting to really pop off. I actually saw some of their TikTok ads recently, and that's how I know about it. But what they've done is actually quite genius. So most of you guys probably know about the self-tanner trend. I mean, it's been a crazy trend for women out there. I know my girlfriend, for example, she's self-tanned before, and I know that some of her friends have done that as well. So this is a really, really big thing. And by the way, I looked at my analytics, and 17% of you are women out there. So if you're one of those women, comment below if you know about this trend. But what this brand has done is they've applied all of that hype to a men's product. So this is a popular trend as well of taking things that are very popular for women and just making it man friendly. So that's what this is. It's a self tanner for the boys. That's kind of their headline, their trademark right there. And as you see, this is the classic men's marketing. It's a little bit funny. It's humorous. It doesn't take itself too seriously. And this is basically a one product store. So they only sell this one product. They're getting really great reviews. They're really fun. And as you see, they're just really tapping really heavily into this humorous marketing, which really works for men. Now, here's the crazy thing. If we look at the Google Trends for men's tan, we see that this is completely popping off. Like this is a really popular trend that nobody saw coming. Now, if we take a look at their landing page, this is a very simple Shopify store. There's nothing really crazy going on. They got some good before and after stuff. They got some instructions on how to use the product and then some reviews, literally just super simple stuff. And again, it just goes to show that the product really is the most important thing when it comes to the success of your e-commerce business. And just a little plug, by the way, guys, Shopify is running a dollar a month Shopify plan deal right now, which is insane for starting your business. All you got to do to claim it is go to any of my videos, including this video, go to the description and then try the first link in there. If you're in the US and Canada and Australia as well, it'll take you to this page and you can claim the deal. So make sure you do that right now. I don't know how long it's going to last. So the sooner you do it, the better. But let's continue with the video. And the other cool thing is that they're doing a ton of organic marketing. So this right here is the meta when it comes to digital marketing. And I know because I run a marketing agency called the Kemi. This is our website right here. And this is exactly what we advise our brands to do. And we have a ton of data on successful brands out there, not to mention all of the research I do for this channel. This is definitely the meta right here, posting consistently on organic social media and then running ads to amplify some of the successful content is such a smart idea. And that's exactly what they have done. So of course, this product has a ton of viral potential. So that's another thing to keep in mind. If you haven't started a business yet, picking something that you think you can make a lot of content around is a really good idea. And that's exactly what they've done. And that's how they can achieve 30 K views on a video, right? 14 K views. And even though this doesn't seem like a lot, it is a lot. And some of these get a million views, right? This one has 8 million views. This is actually the ad that I saw Better that they're running. My right side. I'll show you, but I got to mute the sound. Otherwise, we're going to get copyright claimed and that's not fun. So let's check it out. I'm going to bro glow my right side and not the left side. So he's just going to be showing the before and after. And all right, here we go. I'll just show you the finished product. So after some time, they let it pass. Um, OK, I guess I don't really see a difference, whatever. But a lot of people are really vibing with this. As you see, some guys are like, I'll buy some bro glow if I can buy a hat too. That hat is fire, no cap. So this is what's another good thing about this brand. They created merch out of it, which is fun. It gets people talking about the brand even further. And just to show you, they are also running meta ads. So they're running TikTok ads, of course. And then they're running those same ads on meta, which includes Facebook and Instagram, if you don't know. And then, of course, they're reposting a ton of content on their Instagram page as well. I think they should be posting all of their TikTok content on Instagram and YouTube as well. I saw that they're not posting stuff on YouTube, which they should definitely be doing. I could see some of this stuff get millions of views on YouTube as well. So pretty cool store all together. Shout out to the bro glow guys. I think this product has so much potential for success. I'm sure this will make it to eight figures if it hasn't already. The marketing is so good. It's so personal. I think more and more people are beginning to buy from people as opposed to just 
businesses, right? So if you can put a face to a brand, you're going to have a huge competitive advantage. And it's not a bad thing to be the underdogs. So shout out to the Broglo again. I'd love to connect with you guys and help in any way that I can. But now I want to ask you guys, what do you think about this trend? What are some other trends maybe that you guys are seeing out there that are basically untapped? I'm really curious to know what you think. And that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.